A new edition of Steelers TV. Looking back on the 3-1 defeat by the Coventry Blaze on Saturday night at the arena, I'm joined by player assistant coach Doug Shepherd. And, and Shep, you and I just looked at each other as we walked down here and just went, Ugh. it was just one of those not good nights, wasn't well, it? Well, obviously it was one of those looks because we know we didn't play yeah. our best. You couldn't make excuses or whatever. It was all special teams. Their power play scored, ours didn't. But at the end of the day, you know what, it's, it might be a good thing to lose the first one not playing that well. We could have had our bounces, but if you do lose it, at least you wake up right away. And, yeah. And no, we got to be better next weekend. Any reason why the power play didn't clip? Because in Nottingham on Wednesday, it looked a lot better. It's, it's got gradually better as, as pre-season went on. That's the thing. It, it was clicking the other night, and, and we were feeling pretty good about going into it. But uh, you got to give Coventry some credit. They, they shut us down tonight on and on our breakout. We couldn't really get it in, and when we did get it set up, we had a few chances, but not much to, uh, to sustain pressure. Yeah. Is there a feeling of frustration on the bench when that starts to happen and then guys overplaying things and over trying a little bit? A little bit. You start making decisions that you shouldn't because you're a little bit frustrated. But overall, we, we kind of stick together. We're an older group and, and stick with the game plan right to the end. And we had our chance. We were down, like I said, we were 1-1 with a few minutes to go and like a puck off Basic's mouth and bad break. But, I mean, that's, that's the positive out of it. We didn't play good at all and we had a chance to win it. So, so what do you do now between now and next Saturday and next Sunday when we play Belfast in Belfast on Saturday and then back here on Sunday. Well, what do you, what, what, what's the process of events? Well, that's the good thing. We've got a whole week of practice, Monday through Friday, before we go. So we know we gotta, we're going to break down some video, take a look at it, and then maybe hammer out some systems. Obviously, the power play is going to need a little bit of work, and, and we, get, we get a long week to, before we got our next game. A couple of positives. Kevin Reiter had an outstanding night, I thought. Yeah. And also, Jeff Legui just keeps on scoring, doesn't he? Exactly. Leggy's been on fire since the, it started. And, and Reiter, you know what? If he wasn't playing on top of his game, we would have we would have been down a lot more than we were tonight. He played really well. So the message from you is no need to panic. No, definitely. That's the message throughout the whole, in the locker room. But we do got to get better. We know that, and we, and we will. Do you listen to your assistant coach there? He says, don't panic. If you'd like tickets for the game against Belfast on Sunday, 0114 256 5656. Shep, thanks very much. Hey, thank you.